Do these gauntlets hurt? Yeah, they're um, they're like a a bit a bit powerful, a bit powerful. You see, what they read, they do. What they read, get this, is they upgrade your proxy knife so that the explosion scorches targets and direct hits with it will ignite targets. What they actually do is this. Yeah, like, what? I don't. That's not what it says it does. <laughs> I don't know if they're like bugged or something like that. But for some reason, it feels like 50% of the enemies you kill with the explosion of the knife ignite anyway, even though I don't think they're supposed to. And then on top of that, the enemy you kill with the knife will always ignite. And the thing about like ignitions is they're really fucking strong. <laughs> Not only is their damage, incredibly high, we're talking like almost slug shot levels, but also their blast radius is fucking huge. Yeah, these are these are pretty good. Um and 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 they oh, they only get better. Firstly the second perk states after you throw the knife, uh you will gain increased melee regeneration until it explodes. Um yeah it it kind of just does what it says. It's nothing actually special. It's a bit underwhelming compared to the clear the entire room with one melee part of it. But you know, it helps if you miss. Anyway, on the actual build, firstly, obviously, knock them down. We're gonna be fair and this was knock them down. Knock them down and Ember of Torches. Ember of Torches means our power of melee's attacks will make us and nearby allies radiant. And then, knock them down, among other things, states when you're radiant, your final blows with your throwing knife will give you back your throwing knife. So, now, <laughs> you have cleared the entire room with one melee knife, plus infinite knife glitch. <laughs> one thing I will note about this though, is the explosion from proxy knife will not count as a melee, meaning you have to hit them directly to get the knife back. And then, adding to that, we're going to be pairing this with Ember of Eruption, which means our solar ignitions are going to have increased AoE to basically warm mine cell level, assuring we eliminate the entire floor. But other than that, that's about it for the destructive part of the build. Everything else is just to make it more consistent. And by consistency, I mean sometimes our melee just won't come back, and I have no idea why, to be perfectly honest. So we're gonna need a failsafe, and that failsafe is gonna be Gambler's Dodge, which means when we dodge near an enemy, we get back our melee. But now we need a way to get back our Gambler's Dodge, which is why we're gonna be pairing up with Ember of Searing Signing, I have no idea. This states when you scorch an enemy, which our melee will do basically at all times, you recharge your class ability faster, which is good, but it's not fast enough. So we're gonna be pairing it with these four mods. Two melee well makers, one bountiful wells, and one explosive well maker. The melee well makers means when we get a kill with our melee, we're gonna summon three solar wells, which will give us a class ability. Uh, and then the explosive well maker means when we get a double kill with an explosion, which our knife kind of does inherently, um, we will generate two solar wells, giving us a class ability. And at this point, we definitely have it back enough. And then finally, we're gonna be pairing this with well of life, which states when you pick up a solar well, you get healing for a short time, which will give us a much needed survivability. And that's about it for the build. I very much highly encourage you use it. It is one of the funnest builds that I've used in a while. However, this still technically can get better. I just haven't unlocked it yet. Firstly, you can use this artifact mod to increase your ignition damage and radius and you can see how that works. And then, secondly, you could also switch our Ember of Signing Siri, whatever the hell it is, for this Ember, which means our Solar Ignitions will spread Scorch to enemies, and you can, you can see where that goes. Anyway, that is it for the video. Uh, what's my outro? Enjoy the gameplay, see ya.